Hey guys, welcome back to another video. As you can see behind me, I am at the um, Twizel Canal. Are we oh how a? And it's pretty good flow, so we're gonna drift some eggs and hopefully get into it. Welcome back to another video. I'm back at the Twizel Canals and I'm with my dad this time around. Got my set up, got my sinker up the top and then I've got a wee egg. Tactic is to cast in that slack water. Like that. Keep your rod high. Mend your line. A bit like fly fishing, you don't want that fly line creating drag so you got to mend it. And then try to get your sinker to the bottom and also try to use as light as possible which I've got a real light one on at the moment so I've hit the bottom and we're just going to walk downstream first fish of the trip I don't know how big it is, but I don't think it's too bad. A little bit of weight. <laughs> oh, it's a nice fish. Uh, let's go down here. Probably like. Well, I haven't had a real good look at it, but. Pretty good size. It's a rainbow. Yeah, we're gonna go down. It's going downstream. Yeah, just go down in front of this other one. Yeah, this one here. Pretty good size. There he is. See that ball? Be a nice one to take home actually. You see him. There he is. It's not massive, but it's not a good size to take home. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Oh, there. Yeah. Oh, I still can't see him. <laughs> you just go there and I'll bring him to you. That's just on a wee egg. Yeah. Nothing massive, but good size. Getting your foot wet, you don't stand in the water. That's alright, you just keep it there. Mm -hmm. Hey, bugger. You just keep the net there and I just bring him to you. Lance, <laughs> turn it down. <laughs> there you go. Nice. Not too bad. Yeah, we'll take him home. Nice. Oh, that's the first fish, so nice size to take home, though. No. Yeah. Man. Trip, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just drift, drifting them. I've had about three, four bites in behind here. It's a bit faster than what it was before. Yeah. It keeps going on and off. It'll yeah. stop, and then 20 minutes later, it's back on again. Well, it's one for the books. First trip. Boom. Right. Let's see if we can get another on film. There we go, we're on the bottom. 
four and four casts. Can we make it five from five? Fish are on the bite of Hook the Biggie. Get that big net, Dad. That is a way better fish. It's got some weight to it. Eggs are on the bite. It's quite a heavy fish. Oh. Hey Lance, I got a big one. I got a big one. Hasn't even really woken up. Bro, it's just hanging in front of me. It's just in front of me. Uh, uh, I think it's really big because the head shakes are nuts. Just down in front of me, eh? My dad's got it, but... Just down in front of me, eh? Oh, it's a good size brown. Or a rainbow, brown or rainbow. Just come here, there he is. Oh, it's a brown. Might be six or so pound, maybe a bit bigger. Six or so. I might be a bit bigger than that, eh? Really? Just out there on the surface. What? Do you want to wear my polarized glasses so you can see it? What? Wear those. Put those on. There, look down here. Going up, Karen. Come on, Dad. Going for the walk. There he is. Taking me for a walk. See him? Really? <laughs> yeah, same colour. Yeah, it's got its UV egg, bro. Mate. Yeah. We can't see him. He's way out there. And he's gone. Lost him. Yeah. Broke me off, I think. Oh no, just come off. Okay. Win some, you lose some. So that was a bit of a bugger losing that brown. Yeah, he probably would have been in between that 6 and 10 pound range, I'd say. Um, didn't really get a real good look at him, but when I did see him, he looked yeah, definitely between 6 and 10. But the colour that I'm using is like a peach colour. Um, Trent from Trout Pro makes, made me a heap. Set them down. And for the past few canal trips, they have really been going off for me. So yeah, basically, let's get it in behind that cage as far as you can. Mend that line so it doesn't create drag on the water. I'm gonna get that sinker down as fast as possible, and then. One that slack and walk down with it. <laughs> yep, we're on. It's going hard. I think he's only a wee fella. Uh, I don't know what, what size that'd be. Got a bit of weight. Funny feeling is another brown, eh? Because it's coming in real easy, but it's just heavy. But he's got a bit of weight to him, eh? Hmm. 
nothing like the last one, but. Oh, oh, and he got off as well. Bugger. Yeah, <laughs> good size. It was golden, eh? Yeah, he got off. Bastard. So it's been a pretty good few hours uh, on the water. Only caught two fish, but it's not too bad. Two is better than none. So this is going to be my final cast. I'm going to get it right in behind the pen. Um, keep your rod high. Oh, there was a fish that jumped out there. Try get this to the bottom as quick as possible. But yeah, we, me and Dad are going to go have dinner. So I've only been here for a few hours and managed to get onto a few fish, which is always good. Alright, and that's it guys, that was my last cast, and it's the final one for the day. May come back out after the evening, depends what we do after dinner, but yeah, thanks for watching this video. So we've just finished up fishing, and it was a pretty good session, caught two, yeah two, one real nice one that um, kept for uh, the dinner plate. Another wee one that was a bit small and I lost two really good browns. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to do a few more videos like this while I'm up here this weekend. So yeah, I'm actually with my dad, so... Shut up. It's dad. <laughs> but yeah, hope you enjoyed this video guys and there'll be plenty more to come. Tight lines.